Hello again, thanks for watching. This is another quick tips video from Go Engineer. My name is Joseph Catrona. Today I want to look at how to reset the SolidWorks PDM admin password. If you found this video or if uh, you were sent the video link because you've lost your admin password, first off, don't feel bad. This actually is the top 20th most accessed article on the knowledge base. Uh, for some week in July of this year. So you're not alone and we have a quick solution. The first important question to ask is what version of PDM are you using? Prior to 2014 SP3, this is a little easier than it is today. What I mean by that is that you didn't need to know the existing password back in the day as long as you could access the archive server, whether that's through remote desktop or just accessing it physically, you could go to all programs on the server, archive server configuration. As long as you had access to this application, then you could reset the admin password. Now, if I drill down to a given vault and go to its properties and then log in, you'll see a section for admin user. Now, if this box is checked, it means that your vault doesn't have its own admin password. It's using a global admin password. So in my case, all of these vaults are using that global or default admin password. So I can't change it here under the vault specific properties. I actually wanna just go to the tools default settings. So again, global for the whole archive server and there's a default admin user. So I can reset the password here. Now this is far enough if you're using PDM before 2014 SP3. You'll notice that you don't need, in the earlier versions, you don't need the current password in order to reset a new password. However, we're using a later version, so I'll need to take it a couple of steps further. I'll cancel here, cancel again, and just note that for my vault, is it using the default login or not? In other words, is this checked or not? If it is checked, jump back to this knowledge base article, 065782. If it is checked, we'll be resetting the default password. However, if it has a vault specific password, that's just a different registry hack. So if you're not familiar with the registry editor, you can start by just clicking the start menu and type in reg edit. So we want to see that in the programs there, right click run as administrator. So here we are. If you cannot remember the existing password, you need to do as follows to reset the password. Log into the archive server, start the registry editor. For the default admin, that's me. We're going to look for HKey software, SOLIDWORKS application, PDM. Now I need archive server, Kinesio users. Under that key, I'm going to delete the admin user under the following registry key. Delete the whole key value named admin. That's easy enough. Archive server, Kinesio users, and I'm going to delete the entire admin user. Delete. And that's it for the registry editor. We're finished there, but we're not finished entirely. We actually need to restart this admin console. And the second time you're going to this tool, it's important to know that you can click on it from the start menu a thousand times, if you like. All programs, PDM, archive server. It's just one of those tools that once it's opened, it's really already opened. So look for it on um, any time you're opening it again, it'll be found here under the toolbar, uh, the task tray. So there it is. Now I need to open that default admin user again. And this time I can reset it, but the current password will be blank. So I'm just gonna set it to my favorite admin password, okay, and that's it. From there, I'll be able to use the new password. And that's it for this quick tip. Don't forget to subscribe and leave us a comment if you have any questions. Uh, actually, if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. Or reach out to us, support at goengineer.com. Um, or leave us a comment here. Let us know what you think and what other videos you'd like. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Bye-bye.